hello guys and welcome to today's video now this is a little trailer that i purchased a while back there for the diy projects and local tip runs been a great trailer however plagued with electrical issues as most second hand trailers now one was the seven pin plug that was wired incorrectly and also a lot of corrosion the stranded wires were coming away and causing me lighting issues so I'm not a fan of that method of wiring a plug I rewired it to make sure everything was working check the earths on the trailer and now I'm coming back to this thinking I'm going to redo these connections now the normal way is strip the wire leave yourself enough wire fold the wire over so you're doubling the wire and screwing in those connections to create a decent purchase but as time will sell I found that they tend to break away the standard wires and again causing further electrical issues now I've seen another method where they tin the ends with solder but again that tends to come loose in the fittings because you're not getting a uniform grip so what I'm going to do here today is rewire this plug using the ferrule type bootlace crimps to create a good even purchase and hopefully longer lasting purchase because these plugs tend to get a lot of abuse now each wire has its own location so if you look on that plug you can see they're all numbered all those connections are numbered and this is a UK plug by the way so what I'll do I'll put a little diagram up on the screen just to show you where each wire goes now due to the size of the trailer the blue wire there which I believe is a fog lamp does not require a fog lamp on a small trailer like this so that will need to be suitably terminated I chose to terminate that at the lighting end so yeah you can basically see that they're all numbered for all their locations So let's get this wire snipped down, cut down to size and we'll get those ferrule boot lace crimps on there.
Right, so that's all wired up and ready for connecting back up. And we'll fit that onto the tow vehicle and we'll check everything's working as it should correctly. Now the work on the trailer was done a couple of months back and I've since double checked that connection. All the connections are safe and secure and nothing has worked loose. So I'm quite pleased with that. I hope you've enjoyed the video guys. As always take care and I shall see you on the next one.